This is for all you crazy, wonderful people out there. We're caught up in a madness that, and we're all in it together, me, you, everyone. And if you're not doing something about what's going on, it's because of the madness. Because if you, if you can write a word, if you can write your name, if you can walk or somehow get to a post box, if you can write an envelope, if you can stick a stamp on an envelope, then you can do exactly what I'm doing. And the thing is, there isn't anyone else. There's no rescue party coming. And we're all in alone. But we're surrounded by brothers and sisters. If you're afraid, so is your brother, so is your sister. If you don't know what to do, nor does your brother or sister. The country's full of us, people who don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I write letters, but I don't know what to do about the country and about the situation. I'm having to learn as I go along. I'm winging it like crazy every day. Because I know the person who stops me from doing something is me, only me. And I have to confront whatever it is in me that that stops me. It's not that I'm not allowed to do something. It's not that anybody's restraining me. I'm making a video. Nobody is here to stop me. I'm going to post it on YouTube. No one's here to stop me. I can do it. The question is, why don't I? Why don't you? What's what's the thing that gets in the way and it's in here that's the only place it is there, there isn't I'm not surrounded by oppressors it's a story I carry in my head and in writing the letters I've created a new story for myself I can write the letters and I wrote the first one it wasn't a very good letter I wrote the second one that wasn't very good either and I've winged it and I've learnt as I've gone along and now I do write a letter every day, 218 letters, something like that. And the only person that can get in my way is me. If somebody comes along and physically stops me, well, that, that's, that's not in my hands. What is in my hands is to do what I can do now. And accept the madness of the world we live. The world is mad. It's gone mad. And it's been mad for a very, very long time. And we're all locked into the madness. We're all mad. We don't know how to be free. We haven't... Nobody taught us how to be free. So we accept the prison. But we don't have to. We can learn. But it isn't out there. Nobody's going to do it for us. Nobody can make me free. I have to make me free. I have to do that. I have to release my soul. I have to release myself. And accept that I'm mad. And I am. I know quite a lot about madness. And I am mad. But it doesn't have to restrain me. It doesn't have to stop me living doesn't have to stop me writing letters, protesting. It doesn't have to stop me from saying something's very, very wrong with the world because something is very, very wrong with the world. That's not mad. That's real. That's reality. The question then becomes, what am I going to do about it? That's the question.